adding of a substations. So um, we are looking at adding. The purpose of adding is to protect the electronic equipment, the animals, and human beings. Electronic equipment. Um, against electrical shock or uh, electrical fault so let's see so we're going to explain this so adding a power station and substation so the purpose of adding a power station and substation is to protect the electrical equipment people around the end the um, the substitution from being at fault. So when the when this electrical air uh, thing is taking place so this can be a substation uh, full of generators uh, transformers so there will be a the wire connected to it and then th and all the electrical equipment bonded to the electrical wire so this can be the bare wire and then the bare wire will be connected to the earth rod just a rod a random rod Maybe it can be ten or fifty rods, depend on the and the era of the and the era of the of the substation. So those rods. be like a uh, rod is same thing like nail so it's connected to this so they have different kind and then they would be uh, put in that mat And then covered by the after putting into the rod covered by this the rocks or soil or everything so that when something happened here the the, the earth fault would carry the currents to the earth mark and then this one would be connected to to the fence underground because you'll be putting the uh, the fence here and other buildings close by will be connected to the Edmart this uh, you can see it's an Edmart So um, electrical equipment, ev every electrical equipment that is connected to this one can be a transformer, a big transformer. Can the earth can be connected to the the transformer like this and, and so there will be a shield on the substations or power station shield to protect it against the electrical lightning like if there will be lightning strike there will be a uh, 
uh, a tall eighth pole. You can strike here and then run through the earth. So the tall earth pot and or the shielding protect the substation against it. And lightning, so a lightning can strike in the substation. Then, if it's not connected here, it can burn every equipment here. So, but the, this one will run towards the earth. So, the earth must when testing the earth, it must give you this 0 0.2 ohms to be saved. So, because this one shows that the resistance here, the current can able to pass through here simple then go through another because the current chooses the the lowest resistance to to go through so if there's a lower resistance it will take the the lower resistance uh, path than if you have a uh, 10 kilo ohm it will take this one before this one so make sure that the earth math is close to 0 0.2 ohm some they prefer maybe 0 0.5 between these two so said it's safety for this uh, substation so let's check the equation here anything so state where the following is where and for what purpose the earth mat is used so the earth mat is where uh, the earth rod are connected this is uh, a neat thing this when you you strike this one to go through inside the earth mat so that you can connect to the bare wire the bare wire that you normally see out from houses different houses which th it does not have any insulation so of insulation is connected to the building so this one is for adding so where it's connected into the substation the power station substation oh substation so for what purpose to protect the electrical equipment of women Protect the human let's call installation equipment let's call equipment so yeah this like this the answers. substation or power station so to protect electrical installation electrical equipment and people against earth falls or earth leakage so yeah. or electrical shock for people so that's why they put the earth mat there so there are different way of me earth mat or they use um, salt put it in the ground or something look like coal okay it's carbon graphite then they put it in the ground and then they put salt on top so that's it